Good morning, good morning. Welcome to your next episode of Mastering Your Mind So You Can Master Your Life. How else can I say this hypno coaching episode? We are here so you can rewire your mindset to begin attracting and experiencing those things that you want in your life, right? And so today we are talking about attracting more positive things in your life. Does that sound like something you want to do? Because if so, this is what's probably happening. You feel like there's this negative, dark cloud hanging over you, lurking above you, following you everywhere you go. And as you're going through life, you feel like you're just, you know, it's raining on you all these negative things like Maybe you feel like you're attracting more drama in your life, more problems in your life. Maybe you're getting cut off more when you're driving down the road. Maybe people are getting upset with you more. Maybe you are finding yourself in more arguments. Maybe, you know, you're attracting more of that bad news. Perhaps through emails you're getting, texts that you're getting, um, meetings that you're going into, bills that you're getting in the mail, like whatever it is. Do you feel like there's that dark cloud around you bringing forth, dropping in all of these unwanted things? Put a yes or just say yes if you're listening to this over on the podcast. Um, If you can't type it in right now, follow along, be engaged, be here. You know, if you feel like, yes, like, you know what, Derica, I, like everywhere I turn, Right? Are you in that situation? Everywhere you're turning in your life, you feel like there's one bad thing after the other happening. Yeah? Are you there? Are you feeling that? I know exactly what that feels like. I lived a life of that. Like literally everywhere I turned, here was one other thing I had to deal with, one other bad thing happening, this thing, that thing, that thing, and it felt like I was just being zapped and pulled down and beat down from every corner of life. If you feel like that, there's something awakening in you right now. There's this big calling on your life because you're here. You're listening to this. You're watching this. You're ready to end that pattern. You're ready to rid that negative cloud that's just following everywhere you go. Are you ready? Say yes. Say yes. Like, oh, yes, get that cloud. Move that cloud of attraction that is just bogging me down, weighing me down, creating this miserable life around you, right? Hey, Angie, I see it. Say yes. Good, good, good. You're ready to release that cloud. And so, of course, you are because you are here. Now, what do you do with that? Where do you even begin with that? Because here it is, you're looking out at life and there is this cloud, like imagine this, go, go into this uh, visualization with me. This is how life looks. There's all these people and there's all these different clouds above them, but yet we live on the same planet and then here's this one person with this dark cloud and it's just raining. It's just raining like over them. Like you imagine that just like that cloud over that person and maybe that's you, that person right now, right? And then you look over and here's this other person and maybe their clouds all big, white and fluffy and and maybe there's even a rainbow going through it, right? There's some sparkle and fairy dust, you know, leaving their trail, right? And you're wondering, like you can see all these people, you can see like this environment, this atmosphere around everyone. And yet we're all the same. We all live here in this unit of time. It's not like I'm in the 1900s and you're in the 1800s and there, you know, it's not that we're all, you're looking out at everyone in the same realm, in the same reality, on the same planet, even in the same like city, the same block. And you're like, but yet there's this cloud of attraction that is different over everyone's head, over everyone's life. How can I change my cloud? That's the true question that is permeating through you right now. You first have to understand that we live in an attraction-based universe. Hear that again, sink that in. We live in an energetic world. What does that mean? 
When you hear that, we live in an energetic world. It is attraction based, meaning it is attracting like energy, like frequencies to itself. Now, how does that apply to you? I want you to liken yourself to a cell phone. Ah, I don't have a phone around me, but just imagine you're picking up a phone. Pick up your phone. Maybe you have your phone in your hand because you're watching this. Maybe your phone's around. I want you to just look at that phone for a second. This man-made device. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explain something very deep to you. It's going to be simple yet profound because i got to get you to go there with me. You have to have a breakthrough in this moment to understand your true power of who you are. So imagine you've got your phone in your hand. This man-made device. How does this thing work? This thing. You speak into it and you say, call Susie. Call Susie. You give that the command to that phone. Susie, right, the command is going to send out by frequency, by energy. Frequencies are going to be sent out from your phone to go find that matching frequency. Susie, the command you just gave it. It's going to find Susie, ring Susie, and Susie's going to be talking back to you in your phone. Do you understand this? This, like in that, which you are a hundred times, a billion times more powerful than this phone. Your brain, how you operate as this energetic being living in this energetic world is that when you think thoughts, you are attracting like frequencies back to you. So whatever frequencies you emit, you're going to get. You should write that down. What you emit, you get. This is why there's this cloud over some folks because you have these thoughts of how troubling and hard and challenging life is. You have these, these what thoughts are, they're programs. Programs, what are programs, Derica? Are you going to break it down? You have like like the phone there's data in that phone in your brain there's data programming in your brain and this programming is emitting these types of frequencies negative positive and it's going to attract the negative or positive experiences circumstances people situations manifestations in your life of the of your frequency is this making sense? Put a yes, put a yes. I don't want to lose you here. But you must understand how powerful you are to ever change the cloud over you. You cannot ever be in victimhood and in victorness at the same time. You cannot. It will not work. You must realize that you are actually the receiver transmitter of your life. This is not hocus pocus. It's not smoke I'm blowing up your butt right now. This is the law that we live in. You are on this energetic plane in this energetic world. You must come to that comprehension, come to that understanding, have that breakthrough in this moment that there is nothing by chance just happening to you. That there is no coincidence, oh my goodness, that just happened to me because someone else did it. No. You are victor. You are all powerful. You are captain of your life. You are far more important than, or powerful and important, than that cell phone, than that radio tower, than that light switch, than anything that can, can attract into its mechanism. You are a billion times more powerful than that. And how do you work is by the thoughts that you emit. Your thinking turns into things. You should write that down. Your thoughts turn into things. And I love you so much. Even your depression, your diabetes, your, uh, your relationships of all sorts, everything, your pocketbook, your health, your, your, your abundance, your happiness, everything is created by you. Put a yes. Put a yes if you are feeling this, if you are coming to terms with this, if you know this. Whatever your journey is around this, you must first understand 
how powerful you are and how you operate, how you were designed, my friends. You were designed in this way. I ain't making this up. <laughs> this is how your brain works. It is proven over and over and over for centuries and centuries. This is just how your brain is. You think you emit a frequency. We live in an attraction-based universe. It's gonna attract back to you the same frequency. Oh my goodness, replay that. Write that down. Your thoughts turn into things. So talk to me, talk to me. I see here, you know, we've got some comments that are going, okay, yes, yes, yes. How do we rid that black cloud? I use hypnosis. Many people around the world use hypnosis. I have a specialized hypnosis that is coined relax, release, reprogram. Reprogram is the word you should focus on right now. Because right now you have data in your, let's say motherboard. If you want to compare your computer like the motherboard or the, the wheel that you're projecting in life, you've got data in here you need to reprogram. So if you have negative negative things happening to you, well, you've got negative programming bringing that frequency into your life. So what do you need to do? All my clients know to go press play on a hypnosis. You know what to do. You get in there and you release. You get rid of that programming and you want to bring in the positive programming. Let's break that down. When you have a virus on your computer, you know what I mean? Like imagine your computer, it has negative programming. There's a virus in there. It's gonna run slow. It's not going, it's gonna glitch, right? It's not gonna operate at its top functioning. Like it's not going to when there's a virus, right? It's, it's barely even working. So if your life is barely even working and it's going slow and there's glitches and there's problems, you gotta get the virus out. You must get the virus out. I use hypnosis, hypno coaching to release the virus. You, you hear what I'm saying? This is making sense. Hello, love everyone. Love seeing you here. There's my daughter's on, Jenny's on. You must get rid of the programming. That's how you do it. And once you release the negative programming, the cloud above you is naturally positive. You're naturally positive. You're not a negative person. You're not a bad person. You're not intentionally attracting bad things in your life. You're not doing that. It's just along your way, along your way you inherited these negative programs. You did this by way of experience and by epigenetics. And you get to just release that Therefore, you can have, it's like that cloud over you gets lighter. Maybe it's like a dark, dark matter right now. And then as you begin to release this programming, this virus, let's say, from the cloud, it gets lighter in color. You feel that? It gets lighter. So basically, less negative things are happening, more positive things are happening. And as it gets lighter and lighter and lighter and lighter because you're doing your work, you're releasing, you're canceling out the negative thoughts, you're getting rid of the negative thoughts, you're getting rid of the negative thoughts. And as you continue to do this, this cloud gets lighter and bigger, more loving. And what's happening is that now you have the rainbow life. <laughs> now what's happening is just, it's not an overnight process. This is a process process my friend it's a process it's not going to take you decades to do this but give yourself some time to to lighten the load to lighten the mindset i want you to be patient with yourself and knowing that you are a true success every single day that you're embarking on getting your mind right you are successful one less negative program one less negative thought in your life you are successful. You are so successful. So I want you to remember that. I want you to keep going. 
I want you, if you are not a client and you want this specific hypnosis, which is called attract more positive things in your life, then you would use code attract and get it for a fancy cup of coffee and you can have the rewiring happening for you. Now that is ideal because you can release more faster and you could do that while you're napping. So it's ideal. If you're my client, you, yes, please do. Don't press play now. <laughs> Get in your membership and go press play now. Let you, you're doing this to have this energetic world work for you. We don't have to work this hard. We don't have to, when we have these tools, we have this wisdom, you allow this cloud to just, you let the CEOs, the universe work this magic for you. Start cleansing out, go press play and cleanse out the negative thoughts. You can do this much slower by doing uh, more of a conscious effort, which is harder and slower. What would that look like? That would look like life is so hard. Cancel, cancel. Life is getting better. Reprogram. That makes sense? You know right now what thoughts are creating your black cloud. You know it. It's your negative Nelly. It's your Debbie Downer that talks. These are the programs. It's not you. You're amazing. It's not you. You're love and light. You're positive. It's the program that you must release. So find your program. If you do nothing else today and you just find one, one of the negative programs to release, you've got it. Your life will get better. You are successful. You are powerful. You are in control. Find one program right now. It's not working. I can't do this. I'm not this. I'm not as powerful as someone else. I'm not lucky. Whatever yours is, it's a lie. It's BS. And it's time for you to kick it out. It's time for you to get rid of it because you're just as powerful as anyone else you see walking around with whatever color cloud they have. You are just as powerful. You're so powerful that you created a black cloud. That's how powerful you are. And then you get to decide, let me now switch that to a little lighter gray, to a little lighter color, little, little lighter, 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 until it's, you know, it's just mostly your life. That's what it is until most of your life is just that, that rainbow cloud going on. I promise that can happen. This is happening to you because you're here. So what do you do today? Today I want you, if you're a member, go press play on that audio. If you're not, get this audio. Become aware of your programming. I, you know, you could have inherited from your mom, from your dad from a terrible experience you had growing up. I get it. It feels very, very real. And it is, while it's in there, it's very real. But I care for you so much. And I'm here to tell you how powerful you are. Nothing short of a miracle. You have complete control. And I see these miracles day in and day out. Day in and day out, over and over again. You just need to get rid of that thought. Switch that thought for something more powerful. And my friend, you've got it. You're choosing to, to, to attract more positive things in your life. So this is what you get to do. If you were choosing a more negative life, then there's just, you know, you can choose a negative thought. That's okay. There's no right or wrong here. I'm just guiding in you what you want more of. You want more positive things. Okay then do the work. Get in and get that, that block, that contradicting thought out of the way. And even though it may feel fake, even though it may feel so hard, even though it may feel phony, as you say, life is good, I don't care. You faith it until you make it. Never give up on you. If you don't give up, you will get what you want. If you don't give up, you will get what you want, period. Some people have not given up on their victimhood life and how life sucks and how life hard is. They've never given up on that, so that's all they keep getting. Do you understand? That's what they keep getting. 
but I want you to not give up on something else. I want you to not give up on how you came here to create those goals inside of you, those dreams inside of you. Don't give up on that. So keep going one program at a time. And I mean, one program, you already raise your vibration. You already get better. It's just one at a time, one program per day <laughs> till the new year. And then talk to me, then tell me all the success you're having one program a day. That's your prescription. I love you so much. You got this. Keep going. You're right where you're supposed to be. You have manifested this message. I'm talking directly to you and I'm so proud of you. You got this, keep going. If you have more specific questions around attraction, around what we just spoke about today, put it in the comments. If you're a client, you know how to message me. I am here for you. Let's do this together, one program a day. I got mine too. Let's do this together. Release one program a day into the new year. How about that? So much love. You got this. You can do this. And we're in this together. All right. Talk to you soon.